infinite horizons, unveiling the unknown. In the year 2397, Jack's journey from childhood dreams to scientific marvels was nothing short of extraordinary. As a little boy, he gazed up at the stars with wonder, yearning to become an astronaut. His fascination with space and the boundless possibilities of discovering new worlds never ceased to fuel his curiosity. As he grew into adulthood, Jack's insatiable thirst for knowledge led him to pursue a career in science. His dedication and brilliance were soon recognized, and he embarked on an incredible path as a scientist. It was during this time that he stumbled upon a mind-boggling revelation a wormhole, mysteriously shifting its location after mere minutes and hiding behind an enigmatic pattern. Jack delved into the intricacies of this enigmatic wormhole with unwavering determination. His groundbreaking insights and meticulous research caught the attention of prominent space organization named Stellar Voyage Corporation renowned for pushing the boundaries of space exploration beyond what was once thought possible. In a remarkable turn of events, Stellar Voyage Corporation recognized Jack's genius and offered him an unparalleled opportunity. They assembled a skilled and diverse crew, each member specially selected for their unique expertise, and tasked them with unraveling the mysteries of this wandering wormhole. With his lifelong dream now a tangible reality, Jack, alongside with his crew, they embarked on an awe-inspiring mission through the space-shifting wormhole. As the day of the mission approached, Jack felt a mix of excitement and trepidation. He knew that this mission could change the course of history, but he was also aware of the risks involved. Emily was a brilliant engineer who specialized in designing and constructing advanced spacecraft. Her technical expertise and problem-solving skills were unmatched, making her an indispensable member of the team. She had a knack for thinking on her feet and finding innovative solutions to any mechanical or technical challenges that arose during the mission. With her meticulous attention to detail and thorough understanding of spacecraft systems, Emily ensured the team's safety and the smooth operation of their vessel. Alex, a skilled biologist, had an innate fascination with extraterrestrial life and ecosystems. His expertise in astrobiology and xenobiology made him an invaluable asset to the team. Alex possessed a deep understanding of the potential for life on other planets and was well-versed in identifying signs of habitability. His knowledge of biochemistry and genetics allowed him to study and analyze any potential life forms or organic compounds they encountered during their mission. Alex's open-mindedness and adaptability were vital in unraveling the mysteries of the newfound world. Sarah, an experienced pilot, had logged countless hours navigating through treacherous terrains and hazardous conditions. Her exceptional piloting skills, honed through years of flying missions in extreme environments, made her the perfect choice to pilot the spacecraft through the wormhole and safely land on the other side. Sarah's steady hand and quick reflexes ensured a smooth and controlled descent, even in the face of unexpected challenges. Her calm demeanor under pressure provided a sense of reassurance to the team during critical moments. Together, Jack, Emily, Alex, and Sarah formed an exceptional team, combining their respective skills to tackle the mission's challenges. Their diverse expertise and unwavering determination to explore the unknown made them an unstoppable force. Each team member brought a unique perspective, enriching the overall dynamics of the group and fostering a sense of camaraderie. As they ventured deeper into the space, the quartet faced increasingly complex trials and discovered astounding phenomena. During the mission, while Emily's engineering skills were exceptional, her absent-mindedness with tools often led to amusing situations. 
There was a memorable instance when the team needed a specific tool to repair a critical system, and Emily excitedly announced she had it. However, after rummaging through her toolkit for what seemed like ages, she realized she had left it back in the spacecraft. Her teammates laughed, gently teasing her about her forgetfulness. Despite the setback, Emily quickly improvised a solution using available resources, showcasing her resourcefulness and ability to think on her feet. In their quest to study extraterrestrial life, Alex's affinity for attracting strange space insects became a running joke within the team. During one expedition to collect samples, an unusually large and curious insect latched onto Alex's spacesuit. While their teammates stifled laughter, Alex remained composed, meticulously observing the creature's behavior before gently coaxing it away. This incident highlighted Alex's ability to adapt to unexpected situations and maintain a calm demeanor even in the face of peculiar encounters. The team knew about Sarah's fear of space spiders, and they occasionally found themselves engaging in playful pranks to lighten the mood. One day, they decided to decorate the control room with harmless toy spiders as a good-natured joke. When Sarah entered the room and discovered the spiders, she shrieked and jumped back, startled. The team quickly revealed the prank, and laughter filled the air. Despite her initial fright, Sarah took the joke in stride, and her teammates admired her ability to maintain her professionalism while embracing the lighter side of their shared journey. These moments of showcasing their flaws not only brought humor to the team's dynamic but also highlighted their qualities. Emily's resourcefulness, Alex's adaptability, and Sarah's professionalism were evident even in these lighthearted situations. The team's ability to find joy and support one another despite their imperfections strengthened their bond and contributed to the success of their mission. Jack, the self-proclaimed space enthusiast extraordinaire, took his role as the team leader very seriously, but he had an endearing tendency to get overly excited about the smallest things. Whenever the team made a minor breakthrough or found an interesting rock, Jack would burst into an exuberant celebration, complete with high-pitched cheers and an impromptu dance routine in zero gravity. His teammates affectionately called it the Astro Jig. Despite the occasional hilarity of Jack's enthusiastic outbursts, his passion for the mission was contagious. His excitement brought a lightheartedness to the team, reminding them to find joy in the journey, even amidst the challenges they faced. His teammates would often join in on the fun, creating a harmonious environment where laughter echoed through the spacecraft. Additionally, Jack had a knack for telling space-themed puns and jokes, which, at times, made his team groan and roll their eyes playfully. Whether it was a clever one-liner about interstellar pizza or a playful wordplay on rocket science, Jack's comedic relief lightened the mood during intense moments and helped alleviate stress within the team. However, Jack's boundless enthusiasm occasionally led to minor mishaps. There was an unforgettable incident when, caught up in the excitement of discovering a new star system, he accidentally knocked over a tray of freeze-dried ice cream, sending it floating around the cabin. The team had a good laugh as they tried to catch the wayward ice cream bits, dodging them like they were in a zero-gravity game of food fetch. Despite these humorous moments, Jack's leadership remained invaluable. His ability to inspire his teammates and bring a sense of joy and camaraderie to the mission strengthened the team's bond. Underneath the laughter and antics, Jack's genuine belief in the team's abilities and his unwavering dedication to the mission shone through, driving them forward to achieve extraordinary feats in their exploration of the universe. So, 
With Jackson's factious enthusiasm and knack for comedic relief, the team's journey through space became an adventure filled with laughter, joyful celebrations. Finally, the day of the main mission arrived. The journey through the wormhole was untested, and there was no guarantee that they would make it to the other side alive. Jack and his team boarded the spacecraft that would take them through the wormhole. The journey was long and tense, filled with moments of uncertainty and fear. As they approached the wormhole, Jack felt his heart racing. The moment they entered the wormhole, he felt a sensation like no other. The world around him shifted and twisted, and he felt as though he was being pulled in a thousand different directions at once. The journey through the wormhole was unlike anything Jack had ever experienced. Time and space seemed to lose all meaning as they hurtled through the unknown. Jack and his team were completely at the mercy of the unknown forces that surrounded them. Finally, after what felt like an eternity, they emerged from the wormhole. Jack felt his heart sore as he realized that they had made it to the other side. They had arrived in a distant galaxy, one that no human had ever explored before. But as they landed on the planet, Jack's excitement quickly turned to disappointment. The planet was lifeless and barren, with no sign of the advanced civilization they had hoped to find. Jack and his team had risked everything for this mission, and it seemed that it had all been for nothing. In the distance they see a shiny object and they decide to investigate more closely. As Jack and Sarah approached the strange object, they couldn't help but feel a sense of unease. The craft was unlike anything they had ever seen before, with intricate markings etched into its surface and strange, pulsating lights emanating from its core. The distress signal grew louder as they drew closer, and they could hear faint voices coming through the static. As they boarded the craft, they were immediately struck by the advanced technology that surrounded them. Panels and screens covered every inch of the walls, displaying complex data and equations that were beyond their understanding. As the entire team boarded the spacecraft, their eyes widened in shock and disbelief as they encountered their identical doppelgangers. The air crackled with tension and confusion, and the room filled with a symphony of gasps and whispered exchanges. Jack, trying to make sense of the situation, broke the silence. Okay, this is... Unexpected. Who are you? And what the heck is going on here? The doppelgangers hesitated before one of them stepped forward, a mischievous grin playing on their face. Well, aren't you a handsome bunch, the doppelganger of Alex said, raising an eyebrow. I must say, the universe does have excellent taste in creating duplicates. Alex, not one to back down, smirked and replied, well, imitation is the sincerest form of flattery, but I'm afraid we're the originals here. The doppelganger Sarah, with a playful twinkle in her eye, chimed in, Oh, come on, let's not get into a competition of who's the better version. We're all in this strange mess together. Emily, unable to resist injecting a dose of humor, turned to her doppelganger and said, well, if there's ever a science fair for cloning, we definitely win the first prize. The room erupted in laughter, momentarily easing the tension as both teams found common ground through humor. However, amidst the laughter, Jack's mind raced, trying to decipher friend from foe. He found himself in a state of constant confusion, unsure of when to address his real teammates or their alien counterparts. Jack turned to the doppelganger of Sarah, his voice filled with uncertainty. So, uh, Sarah. Or should I say, Sarah, he said, gesturing to both Sarahs, 
How about we come up with some secret code words to identify the real us? The doppelganger Sarah flashed a mischievous smile. Well, Jack, I have a better idea. How about we both perform our signature dance moves? That way, we'll know who's who. As the tension mounted, the team engaged in a dance-off, each member showcasing their unique moves. There were synchronized moonwalks, robot dances, and even some questionable breakdancing attempts. Laughter filled the room as the extraterrestrial doppelgangers joined in, attempting to mimic the human dance moves but often falling short in hilariously awkward ways. In the midst of the chaos, Emily, with her quick thinking, devised a plan to confuse the doppelgangers further. She suggested that they create a series of complex math puzzles, challenging the aliens to solve them. The team members grinned mischievously, knowing that their extraterrestrial counterparts would struggle with human mathematical concepts. As the dialogue between the team and the Mimicron's aliens unfolded, tensions continued to rise. Despite their skepticism, the team found it increasingly difficult to ignore the overwhelming evidence of the Mimicron's knowledge and familiarity with their memories. Jack's voice quivered slightly as he addressed the alien version of Sarah. So, you're claiming to be the real Sarah? How can we trust that? The Mimicron Sarah stood tall, her gaze unyielding. I understand your skepticism, but believe me when I say that we are the Mimicrons, she responded, her voice carrying an air of certainty. We have accessed your memories and abilities to better understand you, but our purpose here is not yet clear to you. Confusion and unease filled the room as the team grappled with the realization that their memories and identities had been replicated by the Mimicrons. Jack's mind raced, trying to discern the truth from the enigma that lay before them. Emily, known for her sharp intellect, spoke up, her voice tinged with skepticism. If you're truly the Mimicrons, then prove it. Show us something that only the real Sarah would know. The Mimicron Sarah, undeterred, stepped forward, her voice laced with conviction. Very well, she replied. Sarah, remember the time we had that secret handshake back in college? It was our way of communicating without anyone else knowing. Sarah's eyes widened in surprise as memories flooded her mind. The The secret handshake, she stammered, a mix of astonishment and confusion on her face. How? How could you know that? The mimic Ron Sarah smiled knowingly. We are intimately connected to your memories. We possess the knowledge and experiences that make you who you are. Jack, torn between trust and skepticism, interjected, But what do you want from us? Why go through all this trouble? The mimic Ron Sarah's gaze softened, her tone contemplative. Our purpose will become clear soon, but for now, we require your cooperation. Together, we can unlock the secrets of this universe and ensure the survival of both our species. As the dialogue unfolded, the team found themselves torn between the uncertainty of the Mimicron's intentions and the realization that they possessed an uncanny connection to their memories. Jack, in particular, struggled to discern friend from foe, his mind entangled in a web of duplicity. Sarah, still grappling with the revelation of the secret handshake, spoke up with a mix of uncertainty and determination. Okay, let's assume you are the Mimicrons. But why are you doing this? What is your end game? The Mimicron Sarah's gaze hardened, a subtle smirk playing at the corner of her lips. 
We seek to test the limits of human potential. We want to challenge your intellect, your resilience. And in doing so, we shall demonstrate our superiority. A palpable sense of unease settled over the team as they realized they were about to face a daunting trial. The Mimicrons presented a game, an addictive puzzle that would put their mental capacities to the test. Jack, known for his competitive spirit, accepted the challenge on behalf of the team. Fine. We'll play your game. But know that we won't be defeated easily. The puzzle presented by the Mimicrons was a complex and intricate maze, composed of shifting pathways, hidden traps, and cryptic symbols. It required a combination of logical reasoning, spatial awareness, and quick decision-making to navigate successfully. At the start of the game, the team found themselves in a vast chamber filled with towering walls, each adorned with intricate patterns and symbols. The Mimicrons effortlessly deciphered the patterns and swiftly moved through the maze, leaving the team in awe of their seemingly innate understanding. As the team progressed through the puzzle, they encountered various challenges designed to test their mental acuity and problem-solving skills. One challenge involved deciphering a series of cryptic riddles to unlock a hidden passage. The Mimicrons effortlessly solved the riddles, their answers flowing effortlessly from their lips. Another part of the puzzle required the team to traverse a series of suspended platforms, each with a unique mechanism that had to be activated in a specific sequence. The Mimicrons flawlessly coordinated their movements, swiftly progressing without hesitation. The maze itself was dynamic, with walls shifting and pathways changing, creating a sense of disorientation and urgency. The team struggled to adapt to the constantly evolving maze, while the Mimicrons seemed to anticipate every change effortlessly adjusting their course. Throughout the game, the Mimicrons exploited the team's weaknesses, using their flawless understanding of the puzzle to gain an advantage. They strategically triggered traps, causing the team to lose precious time and making their progress even more challenging. The puzzles within the maze demanded both mental and physical agility. The team had to rely on their wits, teamwork, and individual strengths to decipher cryptic symbols, solve intricate mechanisms, and make split-second decisions. Despite their best efforts, the team found themselves consistently one step behind the Mimicrons. The aliens seemed to possess an uncanny ability to analyze the puzzle's intricacies and execute flawless strategies, leaving the team in a constant state of frustration and disbelief. It was this relentless mastery of the puzzle and the team's growing sense of defeat that pushed them to embrace their flaws and think outside the box. In doing so, they discovered unconventional solutions and approaches that disrupted the Mimicron's calculated precision, ultimately leading to their hard-fought victory. As they delved deeper into the addictive game, the team members became ensnared in its complexities. Their flaws, previously highlighted, began to hinder their progress. The Mimicrons, on the other hand, flawlessly navigated the game with calculated precision, exploiting every weakness and flawlessly solving each puzzle. The team watched in frustration as the aliens surged ahead, leaving them in their wake. The room echoed with the sound of the Mimicron's triumphant laughter, amplifying the team's mounting sense of defeat. Doubt crept into their minds as they wondered if they were truly outmatched, their flaws magnified in the face of the Mimicron's superiority. Jack's voice quivered with a mix of frustration and determination. We can't let them win. We have to find a way to overcome our limitations and beat them at their own game. 
As the team delved deeper into the addictive game presented by the Mimicrons, they found themselves increasingly entangled in its complexities. Their flaws, previously highlighted, began to hinder their progress, while the Mimicrons flawlessly solved each puzzle with ease. Jack's impulsive nature led to hasty decisions that resulted in dead ends, while Sarah's perfectionism caused her to overanalyze every move, wasting precious time. Emily's absent-mindedness led to missed opportunities, and Alex's stubbornness prevented him from considering alternative strategies. Frustration and self-doubt filled the room as the team struggled to keep up. The Mimicrons, on the other hand, navigated the game flawlessly, exploiting every weakness and solving each puzzle with calculated precision. Their movements were fluid, and their strategies seemed one step ahead. The team watched in growing despair as the Mimicrons surged ahead, while their laughter resounds in the room again and again more and more acutely. It felt as though the aliens were toying with them, effortlessly outclassing their every effort. Jack's voice trembled with frustration as he spoke. We can't let them defeat us so easily. We need to regroup and find a way to overcome their advantage. Despite their mounting sense of defeat, the team refused to give up. They huddled together, brainstorming and encouraging one another. In the midst of the chaos, they found a glimmer of hope. Jack, always the optimist, suggested a radical strategy. What if we embrace our flaws? Let's use our impulsive nature, perfectionism, absent-mindedness, and stubbornness to our advantage. Perhaps that unpredictability can throw off the Mimicron's flawless calculations. The team members exchanged skeptical glances, unsure if such an unorthodox approach would work. However, they had nothing to lose and everything to gain. With newfound determination, the team returned to the game, fully embracing their flaws. Jack's impulsive decisions became unexpected game-changers, catching the Mimicrons off guard. Sarah's perfectionism allowed her to uncover hidden patterns and clues. Emily's absent-mindedness led to accidental discoveries, while Alex's stubbornness fueled their perseverance. As the team's unorthodox strategies unfolded, the Mimicrons' confidence began to waver. Their flawless calculations crumbled in the face of the team's unpredictability. The room filled with tension as the tide of the game shifted. With each puzzle they solved, the team members regained their confidence. Their flaws transformed into assets, allowing them to outweat the Mimicrons at their own game. In a heart-pounding climax, the team completed the final challenge, leaving the Mimicron stunned and defeated. The room fell silent as the team relished their hard-fought victory, their collective flaws ultimately proving to be their greatest strengths. The Mimicrons, humbled by the team's resilience and ingenuity, conceded their defeat. As the Mimicrons conceded their defeat, a tense silence filled the room. But before the team could fully comprehend their victory, a sudden and unexpected turn of events unfolded. The aliens, who had presented themselves as a united force, began to argue amongst themselves. Their disagreement escalated rapidly, and soon they turned their attention away from the team, engrossed in a heated confrontation. In the midst of the chaos, the team members observed the Mimicrons extracting concealed weapons from their advanced technology. The weapons were unlike anything they had ever seen before, a fusion of sleek design and unknown energy sources. Some appeared as compact handheld devices, while others materialized as holographic constructs hovering around the aliens' bodies. 
One alien wielded a staff that crackled with pulsating energy, capable of unleashing devastating blasts. Another held a pair of gauntlets that emitted powerful force fields, providing both offensive and defensive capabilities. Yet another possessed a wrist-mounted device that projected intricate energy projectiles, striking with pinpoint precision. The weapons emitted a pulsating glow, humming with immense power. Intricate patterns adorned their surfaces, hinting at the complexity of their functions. It was evident that these weapons were not only lethal but also possessed advanced technological capabilities beyond the team's comprehension. As the aliens became engrossed in their internal strife, the team found themselves caught in the crossfire of the escalating conflict. The room became a battleground, with energy bolts and projectiles whizzing through the air. It was a fight for survival, where every move and decision carried life and death consequences. Jack, driven by a mix of adrenaline and determination, fought fiercely alongside his teammates. However, amidst the chaos, the line between friend and foe blurred. The Mimicron's advanced mimicry allowed them to seamlessly replicate the appearance and mannerisms of the team members. It became a surreal and disorienting experience, with Jack hesitating, unsure if he was facing an ally or an adversary. In a moment of confusion, Jack struck out, landing a blow on one of his real teammates, much to the satisfaction of the aliens. The situation grew even more precarious as trust among the team members wavered, and the aliens capitalized on their disarray. With each passing moment, it became clear that a swift escape was crucial for the team's survival. They desperately sought a way out, their minds racing to find a solution in the midst of the battle. The alien weapons posed a formidable challenge, as their capabilities seemed to defy conventional methods of defense. In a stroke of ingenuity, Sarah noticed a control panel nearby, its purpose previously unnoticed amidst the chaos. With a leap of faith, she darted towards it, hoping to find a means of disabling the alien's weapons or accessing a route to safety. As she frantically pressed buttons and manipulated the interface, a previously concealed doorway opened, revealing a hidden passage. Without hesitation, the team rallied behind Sarah, making a daring escape into the labyrinthine corridors beyond. The escape route led them through a maze of interconnected chambers, each presenting its own set of challenges and obstacles. But driven by their survival instinct and the need to protect one another, the team pressed on, using their wits, skills, and occasional brute force to overcome each hurdle. With every step, they distanced themselves from the chaos and violence that had consumed the room. The sounds of battle grew faint, replaced by the echoing silence of their escape route. They clung to the hope of finding sanctuary and regrouping to face whatever lay ahead. Finally, after what felt like an eternity, they emerged into an expansive chamber bathed in an otherworldly glow. It was a moment of respite, a sanctuary where they could briefly gather their thoughts and strategize for the next phase of their journey. As they caught their breath, the team reflected on the harrowing ordeal they had endured. The blurred lines of trust and the conflicts they had faced served as reminders of the precarious nature of their situation. They knew they couldn't afford to let their guard down, for their survival depended on maintaining unity amidst the chaos. With a newfound sense of determination, the team set their sights on their ultimate goal, escaping the clutches of the Mimicrons and uncovering the truth behind their enigmatic agenda. They vowed to overcome the challenges that lay ahead, armed with their resilience, ingenuity, and an unyielding spirit. 
Little did they know that their escape was merely the beginning of an even greater journey, one that would take them to the very heart of the mysteries that lay hidden within the universe itself. The following phrase echoes in Jack's head non-stop, our purpose will become clear soon, but for now, we require your cooperation, the lead mimic Ron stated, her voice carrying a hint of urgency. Together, we can unlock the secrets of this universe and ensure the survival of both our species. The team, now wary of the Mimicron's true intentions, cautiously considered their words. They knew that trust had been shattered, but they also understood the potential value in unraveling the unknown secrets that the Mimicrons possessed. As they regrouped and gathered their thoughts, Jack, with a mixture of skepticism and curiosity, stepped forward. If we are to cooperate, he began, his voice laced with determination, we need to establish trust and transparency. We cannot move forward blindly. The Mimicrons, sensing the team's lingering doubts and the importance of rebuilding trust, made a surprising move. They tapped into the audio feeds that captured the team's discussions, allowing them to hear the debates, doubts, and ultimately, the team's genuine concern for the survival of both species. Realizing the gravity of the situation, the Mimicrons decided to take a leap of faith. They recognized the team's potential as allies, and their own survival hinged on establishing a foundation of trust. With a newfound understanding of the team's perspective, the Mimicrons approached them once again. This time, there was a hint of vulnerability in their voices as they shared the origins of their species. They described their homeworld on the brink of destruction, their struggle for survival, and their desperate quest for a new home among the stars. As the team listened to the Mimicrons' heartfelt account, they began to empathize with the alien species. They realized that their initial judgment had been clouded by fear and the unknown. The shared experience of facing their own mortality in the face of overwhelming odds created a connection between the team and the Mimicrons. This revelation opened a door to dialogue and understanding. The team and the Mimicrons engaged in discussions, sharing their hopes, fears, and aspirations for their respective species. They recognized that cooperation was not only crucial for their survival, but also held the potential for exponential growth and progress. With this newfound perspective, the team and the Mimicrons decided to set aside their differences and forge an alliance. They acknowledged that only through cooperation and unity could they unlock the secrets of the universe and secure the survival of their species. As the team and the Mimicrons continued to build trust and forge their alliance, there came a pivotal moment when the aliens decided to reveal their true faces. The air grew tense with anticipation as the team gathered, unsure of what they were about to witness. With a collective breath, the Mimicrons shed their humanoid disguises, allowing their true forms to come to light. The transformation was mesmerizing and otherworldly. The team gazed upon the aliens in awe and wonder. The Mimicrons' true faces possessed an ethereal beauty, their features finely chiseled and radiant. Their skin shimmered with a subtle iridescence, reflecting the colors of their surroundings like a mesmerizing kaleidoscope. Their eyes, large and penetrating, held a depth of wisdom and knowledge that seemed to stretch beyond time itself. Their physical forms defied conventional human understanding. They were beings of pure energy, interwoven with intricate patterns of light and electromagnetic pulses. Their existence seemed to transcend the boundaries of the physical world, existing in a realm where matter and energy harmoniously converged. Despite their otherworldly appearance, the Mimicrons exuded a sense of grace and tranquility. 
There was a profound sense of interconnectedness in their presence, as if they were vessels of cosmic wisdom and enlightenment. The team marveled at the sight, their initial surprise giving way to a profound sense of reverence. The true faces of the Mimicrons represented not only the advanced nature of their species but also the vastness and wonder of the universe itself. In that moment, a profound understanding washed over the team. They realized that appearances were merely a facade, and the essence of a being lay in the depths of their character, their intentions, and their shared aspirations. The unveiling of the Mimicron's true faces served as a catalyst for a deeper connection between the team and the aliens. It was a visual reminder that beneath the surface, beyond the differences that separated them, there was a shared longing for discovery, growth, and the preservation of life. From that point forward, the team and the Mimicrons approached their collaboration with renewed respect and admiration. The profound beauty and wisdom of the aliens' true faces became a symbol of unity, reminding them of the vast potential that lay within their collective efforts. As they continued their journey together, the team and the Mimicrons learned to embrace the diversity that existed within the universe. They understood that it was through understanding and acceptance of different forms, perspectives, and experiences that they could truly unlock the secrets of the cosmos and pave the way for a harmonious coexistence between their species. The moment of revelation, when the Mimicrons revealed their true faces, became a cherished memory for the team. It served as a constant reminder of the extraordinary beings they had allied with and the boundless possibilities that lay ahead in their shared quest for knowledge, understanding, and survival. From that point on, the team and the Mimicrons worked side by side, exchanging knowledge, sharing expertise, and leveraging their combined strengths. They realized that the answers to their shared challenges lay not in conflict, but in collaboration. The Mimicrons, having experienced the team's determination, resilience, and creative problem-solving firsthand, acknowledged their strengths and welcomed their contributions. They recognized that true progress came from embracing diversity, pulling resources, and challenging conventional thinking. Together, the team and the Mimicrons embarked on an extraordinary journey, unlocking the secrets of the universe and pushing the boundaries of their understanding. They explored uncharted territories, deciphered cosmic phenomena, and unraveled the mysteries that had eluded them for centuries. In this symbiotic partnership, the team's ingenuity, adaptability, and human perspective complemented the Mimicron's advanced knowledge and technological prowess. Through their collaboration, they achieved breakthroughs that neither species could have accomplished alone. As they achieved milestone after milestone, trust between the team and the Mimicrons deepened. They built a bridge between their worlds, allowing for a genuine exchange of ideas, culture, and friendship. Together, they became beacons of hope for their species, proving that cooperation and understanding could transcend even the most profound differences. Their joint efforts not only ensured their survival but also ushered in a new era of shared progress and unity among their civilizations. With their mission accomplished, the team bid farewell to the Mimicrons, knowing that their alliance had forever changed the course of their respective species. They departed with a profound sense of gratitude for the lessons learned and the bonds forged. As the team returned to Earth, they carried with them the enduring legacy of their collaboration with the Mimicrons. Armed with a newfound appreciation for the power of unity and shared knowledge, they set forth to shape a future where cooperation, understanding, and the pursuit of wisdom would guide humanity towards unprecedented heights.